Hello and welcome to another homework help video. This homework help video looks at calculating the employment rate for an economy given the number of employed workers in the labor force. Before looking at how to calculate the employment rate, let's take a minute to review the following terms. Employed workers, the labor force, and the employment rate. An employed worker is an individual who is employed, that is they have a job. The labor force is the sum of employed workers and workers who are unemployed, but actively looking for a job. The employment rate is the ratio of employed workers to the labor force. The employment rate may be expressed either as a decimal fraction or a percentage. For example, the employment rate might be expressed as either as 0.9.1 or 91%. There are two formulas associated with calculating the employment rate, one for the percentage calculation and one for the proportion calculation. If the employment rate is written as a percent of the labor force, then the formula is the employment rate equals number of employed workers divided by the labor force times 100%. If the employment rate is presented as a proportion or a decimal fraction of the labor force, then the formula is the employment rate equals the number of employed workers divided by the labor force. Now, let's look at a typical problem statement. An economy has a labor force of 110 million workers, and the number of employed workers is 105.6 million workers. What is the employment rate using the percentage formula? Before looking at calculating the employment rate, let's look at process using the percentage formula. 1. Write the formula for the employment rate. Employment rate equals the number of employed workers divided by the labor force times 100%. 2. From the problem statement, substitute the number of employed workers into the formula. 3. From the problem statement, substitute the labor force into the formula. 4. Divide the number of employed workers by the number of workers in the labor force. 5. Multiply by 100%. Now let's find a solution to the problem statement using the process outlined in the previous section. First, write the formula for the employment rate. For this example, let's use the percentage formula. The employment rate equals the number of employed workers divided by the labor force times 100%. Second, from the problem statement, substitute the number of employed workers into the formula. In the problem statement, the number of employed workers is 105.6 million. So let's substitute 105.6 million into the formula for the number of employed workers. Third, from the problem statement, substitute the size of the labor force into the formula. In the example problem statement, the labor force is 110 million workers. So let's substitute 110 million workers into the formula for the labor force. Fourth, divide the number of employed workers by the of the labor force. In the example of the problem statement, the number of employed workers is 105.6 million and the labor force is 110 million. So dividing 105.6 million workers by 110 million workers is 0 0.96. Fifth, multiplied by 100%. In this example, the number of employed workers divided by the labor force is 0 0.96. So multiplying 0.96 times 100% is 96%. So the answer to the problem statement is the economy has a 96% employment rate. This homework help video looked at how to calculate the employment rate as a percentage of the labor force. The solution used the formula the employment rate equals the number of employed workers divided by the labor force times 100%. If you want to try a practice problem independently, there's a link in the description below. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, please feel free to put them in the comment section below as well. Here are some additional videos related to this one. Until the next homework, help video best wishes on your economic studies.